Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can regain your quota within your Blackboard site. Whenever you upload an item to a Blackboard site, it's automatically added to the content collection for your site. The content collection acts as a big filing cabinet where anything that you add is stored. This means that if you delete something from a content area, it's still stored within your site. Luckily, you can remove this content if you wish, which will free up some of your quota space, allowing you to add more materials to your Blackboard site. To begin, log into Blackboard and enter into your Blackboard site. From the control panel, select Content Collection and then click on the ID for your course. This takes us to the Content Collection page for this specific course. You can see here all of the materials that have been uploaded into this course. To remove old materials that you no longer wish to use, simply click on the drop-down arrow next to the item and select Delete. If you wish to remove multiple items at one time, you can select the checkboxes next to each item and then click on the Delete button up above. Deleting content from the content collection will free up quota space, giving you more room to add additional materials in the future. That concludes this video about regaining quota by cleaning out the content collection. If you have any additional questions or concerns, please contact the Help Desk at 368help or at help.case.edu. Thanks for watching!